Hard times are coming up. And it's important to stay positive, but it's also important to stay real. Because Madam Toastmaster, fellow Toastmasters and their guests, make no mistake that there is a huge virus, a big pandemic that is going on outside, right at the borders and already here in Poland as well. And some of us, we don't think that it's going to be a big deal. Some of us think that it's going to be horrible. What we already know is that there are hundreds and hundreds of people are dying in places like Germany, Italy, Iran, or China. And it is already in Poland. So probably one week from now, two weeks from now, it is also going to reach us. We are going to see the same situation that we see now there in Italy. And most probably we are also going to be personally touched with this virus. For example, me, I have two parents that are around their 60s and they are in the age group that is, that is uh, in danger. And they are also doctors. One of them is a family doctor, another is a pulmonologist. So they are going to be probably the first ones in my hometown who will encounter the coronavirus and patients that are with the coronavirus. And I fear for them. So these are going to be tough times. And sooner or later, we are going to be somehow touched by this virus. And we need to be mentally prepared for that. And when you see outside, some of you mentioned the great weather, empty Krakow, something that we can all enjoy, but this is the calm before the storm. Because the storm is coming. And what is important during this coming storm? I think what is important is to have a community. A community that you can go back to. And this is offered by those masters. And make no mistake, when you, when you are in isolation, maybe you enjoy it for a week, maybe enjoy it for two weeks, and you can plan your things, and it's going to be nice, but after that, you start to go crazy, especially if you are an extrovert like, like me. If I have no real human contact, I just go nuts. So Toastmasters gives us an opportunity to stay in touch with each other so that we can communicate with each other and not just the regular things, not just inspiring each other it's like do some great things no, it's also going to be time for us to share to share how we feel, what we go through what we experience during the times of turmoil and it is going to be super important for us to keep sane. And I guess many times we think about Krakow Public Speaking Club or Toastmasters International as some disposable hobby that we can just talk the next day. And more or less it's so. It has been so. But it's not like that anymore. We will need something that helps us, that gives us a sense of connection, and that keeps us sane during the times of hardship. So for these reasons, I want to ask you to stay with us, no matter how hard it is going to be, and give each other help. And maybe you have already read the email and also the Facebook post of Tomasz Kociuba, that uh, the renewals are already due. So that for until the 1st of April, or he said that the 25th of March, we will need to pay 190 slotty in order to be the, in order to be and stay the member of Toastmasters International and also of Karkov Public Speaking Club. And we will need this contribution as a community and what we can offer for that, as I said, is a sense of connection and the community that is for now going to be online. Fair enough. I'm not sure that we are going to be able to meet like this next week because the situation can turn bad. 
But if we stay together as a community, then we are going to still be able to come together after a couple of months and be together. So guys, let's survive this together. Please pay your dues and be together again in a couple of months in Krakow Public Speaking Club. So stay healthy, stay safe, and good luck. Maratos Master.